Hi everyone! Welcome to Soup Up Recipes. The weather is getting cold. Now it is the perfect time to make some soup. Let's start with the simplest Chinese recipe, egg drop soup. You probably ordered it many times from Chinese restaurant. Today, I'm going to show you two easy ways to make it. So let's get started. The ingredients are simple. You will need two eggs, crack them and beat it well. In a clean pot, pour in two cups of chicken stock. You can also use water, but chicken stock provides much more flavor. Add some white part of the spring onion. Bring this to a boil. While waiting, mix 1.5 tablespoon of cornstarch and 1.5 tablespoon of water together. When the chicken stock is boiling, slowly pour in the cornstarch water and stir it at the same time so it doesn't clump up. In less than a minute, the stock should be slightly thickened. Next is the egg drop part. Make sure you stir it while adding the egg. In this way, you create an extra silky egg drop soup. You see those thin strands? That is what you're looking for. Add some salt and white pepper to taste. Serve it in a bowl. Sprinkle some spring onion. This is the most basic egg drop soup that you will find in your local Chinese restaurant. In my family, we usually make the ones that has tomato in it. You need to dice a tomato, slice it first, switch an angle, and run your knife through the slices. Then dice it, just like how you do to the onion. In this way, you can get the tomato into fine little pieces. Add some oil to the pot, along with some aromatics grated garlic, grated ginger, and a little bit white part of the spring onion. Stir them until fragrant. Add in the diced tomato. Saute it for about a minute. You will see the tomato become saucy. Add some sugar and salt to taste. If you want to be creative, you can add some protein at this point such as minced meat, tofu slices. I just want to keep the soup simple. Salt and sugar is enough to make a good flavor. The rest of the steps are the same. Bring this to a boil and pour in the cornstarch water. After the soup got thickened up, stir in the egg as well. Serve it in a bowl. Sprinkle some spring onion. This is the style that my family makes all the time. It has a little touch of sweet and sour taste. It's very nice for such quick and easy soup. Usually, this is not the only dish that's on your dinner table. I'm serving it with some stir-fried chicken and white rice. It's very soft, creamy, and velvety. It can go with almost any dish. It's cheap, but it comforts your heart. I so, hope you give this and my other recipes a try soon. If you haven't yet, click my channel name and find out your favorite Chinese food. New videos coming out every Wednesday, and I'll see you next time. Bye!